the second part of our two part video we will show you how to run two virtual machines each with its own dedicated display the hardware environment which is the same as what we used in the first part is an intel kb lake nuc two touchscreen 1080p hdmi monitors a keyboard and a mouse the intel nuc has ubuntu running as the host os besides the celeron virtual machine we have added a windows virtual machine as a second virtual machine Now we launch the two virtual machines. Before the virtual machines boot, two virtual GPUs will be initialized, one each for Celeron and Windows virtual machine. At the same time, two displays are assigned to the two virtual GPUs. Each virtual GPU gets one dedicated display. Then the Celeron and Windows virtual machines can use their dedicated displays after booting up. We boot Android first. Once Android is ready, Windows is launched via the scripts. Now that Android is ready, we can use the touch screen to operate Android. At the same time, Windows is still booting. Via touch screen, we can browse photos in gallery and play video as usual as with native Android or a single virtual machine. We can run all Android applications on the Celeron virtual machine. Simultaneously, we can operate Windows Virtual Machine via keyboard and mouse and perform operations such as editing a new text file or playing a video. In this context, the two virtual machines, Celadon and Windows, are running independently in their own QMU instances. We can operate them at the same time. For instance, we can browse photos on Celadon while editing a text file on Windows. That is. Celeron and Windows are running like two separate machines on a single Intel NUC. That concludes this video. Thanks for watching.